from WA. Hard to believe she was racing eight years ago. The time's flying, no doubt about that. Let's see what Red Hot Tears can do this time. Set to go. Little brother to the recent track record holder. Away. Jumping well, the favourite, and he's going to drive through. Going out fast, Havana Miss to lead Red Hot Tears. And now railing through, Slingshot Hammer. So Havana Miss pressed big time by Slingshot Hammer. A length and a half to Red Hot Tears on their tail and then Sank Destructor. They're followed by Kraken Buster, Mr. Harley wouldn't fall the Alliance last. Down the back and Slingshot Hammer slipped away, put up four to Havana Miss and then Red Hot Tears as they round the home bend. Slingshot Hammer, he's all out but three clear to Havana Miss and Slingshot Hammer's too good by length. Havana Miss who really grounded out well. Third, a photo. It'll be Sank Destructor, probably three quarters at the end of Red Hot Tears who tied up the home straight, then Mr. Harleywood, Kraken Buster, and one of the last in for the Alliance. It's 34 and 30. How about the run of the, the runners up? You don't want to take away from the winner, but Havana Miss was outpaced mid-race, but she grounded out big time, will pay about $14 a place, and will finish off in second placing ahead of the four, but it was Slingshot Hammer who's been the class to get home and win. One, five, four, and three. Winner of the race, number one, Slingshot Hammer. He just knows how to win races. Dev Coleman for Rob Camilleri. Fernando Bale, Little Hammer. He's turned out to be a great purchase for the Camilleri-Coleman combination, having a, a successful career over a long, sustained period of time. Havana Miss, she's getting better and better.